morning, this is Al Gettler of the Eagle Tribune. We're going to take the journey from Wyndham down to the Eagle Tribune this morning, see just how long it takes. Well, I thought I'd get out of here without uh, having to blow the snow, but apparently uh, that's not going to be the case, because it's uh, already enough justified clearing the driveway once. So we'll get it cleared and then... Well, the snow is a lot worse in the driveway than I thought it would be, uh, and so now it's 7.38, and uh, we're going to head into uh, uh, North Andover from Wyndham. The streets are uh, are not plowed really at all, so we'll see where it takes us. As I was leaving, the plow just literally came up the street for the first time, so you can get an idea of what that looks like. Well, at 7.56, I'm on 28. Lights just turned green. As you can see, the visibility is down pretty low. At Today is the grand opening of the brand new market basket in Salem, New Hampshire. And uh, you would think perhaps that uh, that, that wasn't going to happen. But as you can see, uh, people are here and looks like uh, the market basket grand opening is going to occur with or without the snow. So I'm uh, pulled over here uh, on Broadway in, uh, in Lawrence, and you can see that the snow's coming down at a good clip. Uh, people are out and about um, and getting cleared out, but the snow uh, continues to fall heavily and even tough going for pedestrians. Okay, so it's 8.20, and I've uh, made it to the corner of uh, 110 um, at Havel Street and Broadway here in Lawrence, and um, again, as you can see, slow going. All right, 829, and uh, I am uh, here uh, on 28, uh, just entering Andover. Uh, lots of people have lots of cleaning up to do to get their vehicles out and their walks cleared. Well, this uh, frozen traffic light at Waverly uh, seems to say it all. Uh, use caution. Streets uh, are, are uh, tough. I'd say in Andover, the, mar the conditions got just a, a little uh, less than friendly. But, um, you know, right now it is uh, 8.34, and I'm around the corner from the Eagle Tribune. So, 8.38, and I'm here at the Eagle Tribune. Conditions have changed just a little bit, starting to see a little bit of frozen precipitation mixing in with the snow. Uh, all in all, uh, a, uh, a tough ride for anybody without a four-wheel drive vehicle. And uh, certainly uh, encourage you to stay home for as long as you can, and uh, just keep checking in with us at eagletribune.com.